it counts how you play the game. School, work, home, relationship, survivor, business, it doesn't matter. When you treat yourself and others with respect, you will always be that winner. I'm not saying you're going to get a million dollars for treating people right, but you know, I did. I, Jeff Ropes wrote a check for a million dollars and handed it to me just because I played the game with a little bit of honor. Not because I won, not because I was the best liar or the best manipulator, but because I played the way I think we all hope we would play. You know, not being any angel. I mean, I stole shoes and I, I would go to Boston Rob and say, Ooh, Big Tom's trying to get you. Then I go to Big Tom, Ooh, Boston Rob's trying to get you. I'm the only one you can believe. But, you know, in a pirate's adventure in Survivor, I'd like to think that I played it with at least my morals, my values, my world still intact. When I walked out of the game, I, I know, I realize. It doesn't matter what test you put. It, it 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 helps you to be that good guy. Just like last night, watching Matt get sent back to to, to Redemption Island. <sighs> the poor kid. <laughs> he wanted to do what's right so bad, and he trusted Boston Rob, and Boston Rob just got him. But. You know, he will, he will be that one, I hope, that is rewarded for being true to himself, going back to a tribe that already beat him down once and saying, okay, I forgive you and let's try it again. Hopefully he doesn't do it a second time. If he makes it out of Redemption Island again, I hope he gets Rob and all of them darn people. I'm for Matt. Now, Matt's my guy now.